All right, we're here with Ethan Newberry, the ginger runner. That's me. Tell us how the gorge treated you today. Uh, it was amazing. Um, I actually didn't expect it to be as technical as it was, but it was gorgeous. Uh, every mile there's either a waterfall, a creek crossing, or lush, lush jungle type rainforest. It was probably one of the most beautiful races I've ever run, and I will be here every year. It was awesome, awesome. Is this your first, uh, wa uh, well it's not Washington, Oregon race? Rain shadow race? Yes. First Oregon race, first rain shadow running race, uh, James puts on, I mean, this is top notch. Um, every one of rain shadow running races I want to run. Uh, I just can't believe it. Hey, there's a dog! Hi! Uh, every single one that he puts on, I want to sign up and I want to run now. If it's anything like this, it's going to be impeccable and amazing, so yeah, I'm stoked. Yes, yes you will. Yes. So what's the rest of your summer look like then? Uh, I got a couple races coming up. So next race on the calendar is the Big Sur Road Marathon. Really excited about that, it's beautiful. Uh, after that, we have Western States Training Camp. I'm not running Western States, but a bunch of my friends are, so we're gonna do the Training Camp, which is three days of epic runs. Uh, I'll be doing the San Francisco Marathon, uh, Cuyamaca 100K, and right in the middle of the summer is the big granddaddy. I'm doing the Squamish 50-50, which is 50 miles on Saturday, 50K on Sunday. Uh, I'm gonna get my ass handed to me, and I can't wait. Can't wait. Gary Robbins puts on amazing races, so I'll be back up there in Squamish, BC. Can't wait. I remember seeing that video, so you're going up for the double beating. Double beating. I mean, if the 50 mile wasn't enough, why not do a 50k the day after? Right. I'm an idiot. Uh, I'm going to say that right now. I'm an idiot, but I'm really, really excited. So. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, Ethan. You gotcha. Have fun. Thanks, man. Appreciate it.